We're Jillian and Jonas, and after living aboard our 30-foot sailboat for over a year, we've decided to hit the road and travel across the country in our newly built van. Like and subscribe to follow along as we drive from coast to coast. So to start our day, we just drove up the way maybe a minute or two from the campground because last night we had seen a Terry Fox uh, memorial site. And you can also see the Sleeping Giant from here, which is this mountain range that looks like a Sleeping Giant. You know more. Yeah, it's like a peninsula that comes out into Lake Superior. It was too cloudy today, so we couldn't see the, yeah. the head and the body. But on a clear day, it looks like a, a big, yeah person laying in the water. It's kind of funny, we, as we were like looking out, um, a bus arrived and we didn't realize it and all of a sudden this huge <laughs> crowd of people just started like crowding the monument. So um, luckily we had a chance to see it and yeah, now we're gonna head out. We have a really short driving day today, only about two hours. So we're gonna take our time and see different stops along the way, which is kind of nice. It'll be good to take a bit of a break from driving and do a little more hiking and walking and yeah. We just found the cutest little town, I guess is what you call it, um, Silver Islet, founded in 1869. And we just went to the general store here. The store was established or opened in 1871. And yeah, very cool. So just off the peninsula, there's an island that was uh, quite a large silver mine, um, boat access only. So the store here was set up to service the workers at the mine and um, yeah, for all their goods and things. Yeah, yeah, we met the family and I, it sounded like it's been in the family for that, for that whole period of time. Um, a younger generation has now taken it over 
and yeah it's really cool to see it's just this family business they put a bunch of work into it a few years ago um, they put like a new roof new windows to kind of get it back up and running and really cute little place um, yeah I'm really glad that we found it What just happened? <laughs> I dunked my man bun in that little puddle bag. <laughs> oh, damn. A little bit of leg superior in you. <laughs> I just said I was going to lie down here for a long time. I wasn't going to get up. <laughs>
I should probably hop in right here, hey? I know, this is like the longest I've ever been in cold water. <laughs> mm. Mucky. Yeah, it's really slimy. <laughs> We're at 60,000 fathoms below the sea, below Lake Superior, and we have spotted the Ogopogo. We're in search of it now. We're trailing it. You hear it? There it is.